안녕하세요. 저는 루입니다. 안녕하세요. 저는 리안입니다. So today's our fun day. We've formed chicken noodle soup today, Danger. We're forming just a fun reaction to RM on VLive. So we're going to do that now. And yeah, and we, uh, we also formed a giveaway, which we're going to post our giveaway video. It's probably already posted by the time you see this. So uh, go and participate in that for a BTS merch giveaway. Um, yeah. The other thing is, yay! The other thing is that um, if you want to see our bloopers, because there's many of them from all of our videos, please jump over to our Facebook page and or see Instagram. Instagram or Instagram and see us be complete weirdo, crazy asses, because we are we are just that. So yeah, anything uh, that gets cut out and doesn't make it to the final videos we tend to keep little clips and stick them on instagram tiktok <laughs> and facebook but mostly instagram yeah the other day lean was calling me princess die because of my hair so <laughs> <laughs> okay let's get started with rm out of soul out of soul let's do it okay out of soul out of soul <laughs> 오늘 배워볼 영어는 바로 pardon인데요. 아 바로 스펠링은 p a r d o n pardon입니다. 뭐라나나나 pardon 이렇게 해줘야 아, 됩니다. 다시 한번 볼까요? 하나 둘 셋. pardon. 그렇습니다. Example one, situation one, listen and repeat. pardon. 네. 나 나. There's a river in the sky. Alright. <웃음> 사실 저는 좀 약간 그래도 방탄에서 나름대로 장식을 맡고 있다 보니까 전시 위주로 찍어주신 사진이 많은데요. 어쨌든 이런 사진을 셀렉해 주셔서 정말 감사하다고 저, 말씀을 드리고 싶어요. 질문이 있습니다. 뭐냐? Just realized there are subtitles on it already, and it's just yeah, like yeah, yeah we. You never have to put subbies on these ones. <웃음> Okay, so I wanted to show you this because you don't know enough about RM. You know some. You know he's a good leader. <clears throat> you know that like he's a good rapper. You know that he's poetic. You know that he likes to read and bicycle and stuff. But now would be like, a good time to tell them that what have I long been when it comes to RM? I feel intimidated by him. <laughs> she does. Yeah. She said if she ever met him in person, she'd be like totally intimidated by him. Because he seems really clever. And even though I'm not stupid, <laughs> he seems <laughs> too clever. <laughs> and I would feel really stupid. Well, and the thing is, is like, that's, I like this goofy energy that he has. It so. makes him more human and less intimidating. I think, you know what it is, why he intimidates me? He's a Virgo, right? And my stepdad's a Virgo. And uh, he has that same, like, commanding way about him. And I think <laughs> it comes from being super respectful by, about my stepdad. So, I like, I see the same things in RM, the same energy. So, he intimidates me. <laughs> <laughs> well, and he, I think he intimidates a lot of people. But at the same time, I think, like, getting to know him, he's probably very different to how we see him. I think he's one of the few people in the world that would be able to tell me what to do. Because you know what I'm like, if someone tells me what to do, I do the exact opposite. I feel like <laughs> if RM told me to do something, I'd be like, I guess me need that. I guess me need that. <laughs> <laughs> like what, what scares me is his passive aggressiveness. Like if he ever gave me that energy, like he gives some reporters, I would die. I would be, that would be my last day on earth. I'm very passive aggressive. That but doesn't faze me. It's his, it's his order of command and his cleverness. And it's just like <laughs> his presence that he seems to have. I would totally just be like, yes, I guess me need that. <laughs> he just intimidates me. I don't know why. There's no like actual logic because he seems like a really nice person. Yeah. And you know what I'm like? I'm a total wild rebel that doesn't let anyone tell me what to do, but he totally would. Yeah, <laughs> 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 
기타 여자 애들이 소개할 수 있는데 전 너무 했고요. 맞습니다, 아, 여러분. 여러분은 모르시겠지만 레몬 형도 아무 디스를 자주 한다. 야, 니들 맨날 이거 했잖아. 아니야? 아니, 니들 맨날 이거 했잖아. 왜? 아이, 입이 중요하죠. 좋습니다. 좋습니다. Hi, international fans. Hi, guys. I love you. Me too, baby. Your, your smile is so contagious. <laughs> Remember I told you that I had a friend who is totally like RM. Yeah. This just solidifies that. He has the exact personality, <laughs> which is weird because he doesn't intimidate me though. And he's also Virgo. He, he, this could be him. Like this is who he reminds me of so much. He's, I just love his like aura. I love that he's like, like, awkward and clumsy and energetic and, and then sometime a poor lady killer in those little flirty moments that was very oh, yeah. smooth hey, very baby. much baby. hey baby. baby how are you doing how are you hey, doing, how are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah he definitely reminds me of my friend whom i actually really got on along with so i probably would be fine with him he just yeah. don't have dates me though <laughs> <laughs> <웃음> 원내 만내 만내 어, 제가 할 뻔하긴 했는데 어쨌든 뭐 제가 했으면 큰일 날 뻔했어요 근데 뭐 호비가 너무 잘해서 지금 인트 센터에서 춤도 추고 제가 그 춤을 출 수는 없지 않습니까 센터에서 아무튼 <웃음> 이게 원래는 제가 랩에다가 쓴 What? 부분이 그거였어요 원내 만내 만내 He talks so fast. I never noticed that before. But when he's excited, he talks like you do. He, like <laughs> run on sentences. He talks really fast. When I've he's noticed excited. that with all the BTS when you've showed me clips where they're not talking to the camera, they're talking to each other and there's a camera following them around. I've noticed that Koreans talk really fast. Maybe it's because I also speak to like Teo and stuff and I've heard Teo yeah. speaking to their family in the background. Koreans talk really fast. They do. But then when you compare him to like... V, RM speaks much faster, I think. Like, he's more like, only when he gets excited he's about hyper. stuff. He's hyper. And it's not in front of the camera as far as like interviews and stuff. It's only it's when excitement just... induced, it seems like the same with me when I get like excitement induced. That make like I will talk hundreds of times faster. Well, and the weird thing is like, I only learned this like about two months ago that bts considers rm to be the most energetic member and i would never have said that from all the footage that i've seen over the years but then when i see things like this i can see why they say that and they say like sometimes when they were working hard and they only had like a couple of hours sleep at night and they were like working throughout the night and then he still maintained huge energy like and i think there was something i read the other day about somebody who worked with him who said that they were talking about each member and they said RM has huge energy. Like he comes on set with massive energy. And like, <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> Swallowed it in my air hole. <laughs> <laughs> in your air hole. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. Um, but yeah, I kind of like feel like like I would have think J Hope would have the most energy or you know, but like RM apparently does. I don't know, Virgos be like that. Every Virgo I've ever known has been <clears throat> they have like two faces. They have that mature, calm, presented side where they are like commanding and kind of bossy, but they all have like crazy amounts of high energy. Like my stepdad used to cycle ten miles in the morning and come home and play football with us and then be like, Oh, let's go drive and climb a mountain <laughs> and go to the beach and it was always on, on, on if my stepdad yeah. was the one in charge and my friend who was the Virgo was in the army and he would come home and leave and he'd be like let's go a 10 mile hike like <laughs> seriously just calm the hell down dude it's a saturday and i'm hungover and shut up and sit down like i definitely see that as like a very virgo thing to be high yeah. in energy but also to present as much more calm and stable okay ready ready <laughs> Maybe I can never fly. This part. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. 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 
항상 이렇게 표현하려고 하는데 이제 잘안 되지만 이 더, 이 더, 네. 아, 기쁨을 한번 흘려보겠습니다. 지민 씨. 네. JK seems calm and quiet next to RM there. He does. <웃음> But look at RM how observant he is of his members. He's always so observant. Like he's really spotted that Jimin's Jimin's crying, and he's like concerned. You can see the observant leader. Yes. Ah, ah. Jimin, Joe. We. Ah, 진짜 말들이 안 돼. 지금 울어? 지금 울어? 나도 안 돼. 울어? 나도 안 돼. 나도 하고 싶은 말은 야. 네, 앨범. 야. 네. 좋은 앨범 더 그전에도 굉장히 어떻게 보면 선생님 보기 되게 Just a little observation there. V was wearing Sugar's hat. Oh, was he? <laughs> They love sharing clothes. It's so cute. <laughs> 있는 편이었어서 나 아무튼 다 하나 자신 말씀이 <laughs> 네가 네가 아이돌 하고 있다니 참 세상이 좀 인생 오래 살고 볼 일이라면서. Funny, 네. I heard the same thing. 그런 말씀 많이 하십니다. 네, 광기야. 저는 무조건 저는 시인 아니면 작가를 할줄 알았어요. Fun fact. So remember, at my high school wasn't exactly the most supportive of high schools because I was like a pretty hopeless student. <laughs> <laughs> so after I left, like I moved 200 miles and joined the girl band. I, like I totally left the entire county. I found out afterwards that they had newspaper clippings of us and the girl band up in the main halls of oh, the school oh, and so they had cute. framed one and had a little thing on it. It was like ex-student Leanne Marshall and like a girl band sisterhood. It was up in the hallway. I was totally mortified. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, oh my <laughs> god, stop it, stop it. Yeah, but I think they said I they were surprised to, to find out that I had become like something like that. <laughs> That is so funny. And I think also like with RM, he was like such a like genius level student. They were probably expecting him to do something like, I don't know, be a scientist or a businessman or something. So like it was totally unexpected, I bet, for them. See, I was like, even though I was like rubbish, I was like still a high grade student because I had to work really hard. So even though yeah. I was like never liked getting told what to do and stuff, I still had really good grades. I just struggled a lot and I skipped class a lot and I was always in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> But they did think I was going to go on to do something smart. <laughs> And then when the headmaster found out like I was in an idol band and a girl band and they had put these papers up, we went back for a visit not long after and I was speaking to my old English teacher and she was like, oh yeah, the, his name was Mr. McKenzie. Mr. McKenzie was so surprised. He was like, I was, <laughs> would be like in something clever. <laughs> What's not clever about music? Like, yeah, It's like, so funny. When I was in the middle 여러분의 인생이 또 바뀔지 모르니까요. 꼭 한번 살아보시고 열심히 살아봅시다. And I'm saying that, you know, there are a lot of people, you know, who are watching this currently, and you know, there are a lot of youth and young people who feel like, you know, they're strange. You know, am I like like the song? Am I wrong? Am I? You can tell he learned his English from watching American speakers. He did. He has the most Americanized Korean English accent I've ever heard. Like for somebody that was not raised in America. Totally. Like Tao totally. was born in America, but even though they're Korean, they moved back to Korea. And she still has, they, sorry, still have a very Americanized English accent, but with just little hints of Korean. He sounds exactly like Tao does. That's crazy. Am I, am I too thoughtful? You know, am I having too many thoughts in my mind, too much chaos in my mind. Am I only the person who think like this? You know, I think too many times and again and again and again, and I don't feel really sometimes desperate. And what I, what I could see is that so many people in the world right now felt the same thing. I think, and that's, you know, that can be named after. Boy has severe anxiety and is an overthinker. Yeah, and he was talking, he's, in the story, he's saying that he spoke to his teacher about it, about like, and I think he's also talking about a lot of youth, especially in Korea, is he's like, from what I can understand from this, because I've seen this before, there's a lot of youth in Korea that are very anxious and stressed about their future. Mm. And yeah, so he's, he always told, remember also Eugene, she spoke to us about that, that's why he sent his kids to the States to be educated. Yeah, to so I escape think. escape from that pressure of the education system. 
Yeah, and this is on VLive, so don't forget, RM's trying to, like, I think he had read a question or something where someone was saying that they were stressed about their future, and so he's trying to reassure them here, which is really cool. He is a very sweet boy. Like, yes. you know, cows or, you know, youth or many things, but um, I just want to say that, you know, a teacher told me that, uh, you know, in 20s, you if you have so many thoughts in, you know that's like branches in the in a tree it's like you know if if my brain is a tree like there are so many branches you know you know there's sadness there's desperation you know devastation you know there's happiness hope everything but you know when you get old you know it gets you know, cut when it gets some shape of a tree we have to you know feel pain and there's a random we have analogy to experience many things <laughs> you know for the time after that, in 20s, I mean, like in 30s and 40s, if you got so many branches in the, your 20s, you feel sad and you sometimes, you know, get lost. Like, like I said in the song last, if you get lost, maybe you someday you finally be a, a really beautiful tree, you know, in your 30s and 40s. Like I sometimes meet some really good, you know, like, I mean, like cool, I don't, I don't I don't know the word but in adult old people they got the attitude you know like they experience Adam talks like we do he goes he off does. on tangents and he talks around in circles and he, he like does. he comes off the main point and you kind of lose what you're saying and then he'll eventually come and then back he pulls it in again he does <laughs> the whole he's you can see he's a poet and a writer because he does that wind you know and that's I what we do yeah, we do. And I, I understand exactly what he's saying. I mean, like for me, I'm hoping I'm going to be a beautiful tree, maybe in my fifties and sixties, but, um, I understand exactly what he's saying is like, when you're in your twenties, you're all over the place. You don't know what your career is. You don't know where you should be belong. Like, are you going to be married? Are you not going to be married? Are you going to have kids? Are you going to, like, where are you going to stay? Like there's all these things and like, it's chaos and confusion. And then as you get into your thirties and your forties, you start to understand where you're supposed to bloom, you know? So I can understand that analogy, you know, I kind of like, I love the way his mind thinks. And I think it's so awesomely cute that he's in his little PJs with his, he's just, I had his like little shower and stuff. And he's just chatting to army about that. It was really cute. See, I'm not a tree. I'm a fire bush. <laughs> <laughs> All her branches are ablaze. <laughs> I, I, I like started a, when I was like a teenager, and it's never really changed. I'm like a weathered, we, weathered piece of coral. That's what I am. <laughs> it's like a burnt bush. I am. You're a tree. He's coral. I'm he a wants to be a nice big green tree. He's doing really and well. And sugar's a rock. <laughs> sugar's a stone. He's a rock. <laughs> yeah. There's so many things. So maybe we we can one day have that someday. I'm going to more than that. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like <웃음> 아미 생각 그건 물론 하고요 항상 슈가 형이 저에게 이뻐로처럼 얘기했지만 세계 평화를 위해 운전을 하지 말라고 했기 때문에 저는 아마 20대 때는 제가 운전할 일은 없을 것 같습니다 <웃음> I said I totally support Adam's not driving okay yeah because you don't drive hey no I've tried I've had many lessons many many lessons and uh, <웃음> not just as one instructor either and it was over a span of five years. And uh, yeah, <laughs> never gonna be You were told driver. never to drive. Yeah. Well, You're see, a danger you, on the road. The driving instructor said, I feel like you just need more time on the road to build your confidence. My dad said, hell no, never again. But my boyfriend <laughs> said, maybe it'd be best if you just gave up. And my <laughs> other brother said, no one should ever give you car keys. So there's that. <laughs> <laughs> I think Ari mentioned that as well. Like people have tried to teach him to drive and it's chaos so Yeah, it's I'm funny. chaos behind a wheel. I'm terrible. <laughs> Please speak a little English. English. Hi, hello. Today we have a nice weather here. Kanye or Kendrick Lamar? Kendrick wow, that's, Lamar. That's hard, but Kanye still. 
Oh, yeah, those are back in the day. Like, back in the oh, day. Yeah. Uh, as of always, he has had some good tunes. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> Yupa. Do. <laughs> Save me from tears. I'll give it to someone special. I swear special. he's like you when you have sugar. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. Hi, very next day. Hi, 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 Whatever the boy was eating during that live, he like <laughs> <laughs> maybe he's like me. Maybe he's allergic to um, certain food additives because that is me. Whenever I have tartrazine in any kind of orange food, oh, <laughs> you have yet to experience that. <laughs> this is I deliberately me. avoid orange-colored like fake foods because this is how I get worse. This is when I found you with weird. Frantic voice messages. This yeah, is this me. is your voice notes when you realize we're doing something you're really excited about. <laughs> so funny. He's now, he's like mad with the company here. It's so funny. It's not that you can tell. He's just hyper excited about everything. So, yeah. 하지만, <laughs> 여러분, 이번 포스터는 좀 잘못된 것 같습니다. 제 한마디 해야겠습니다. 어떻게 저를 저 끝으로 보내버릴 수 있나요? 그 한껏을 찍으려고 트램펄린 위해서 나중에 비하인드가 나오겠죠? 정말 다섯 시간을, 아니, 다섯 시간까지는 좀. 오바이트가 한 시간이 아니라 거의 다섯 번을 막 뛰고 막 목을 막 진짜 난리 부르스를 쳤는데 어떻게 그 컷을 쓰실 수 있어요? 그것보다 훨씬 잘 나온 컷이 많았는데 그리고 나는 뭘 리더라서 이끈다고요? Swear to God, that's a gen rant. That's a me rant. That's what I get like when something annoys me. Like, how could you put me in the corner? Oh my God, did you see that? Five hours are jumping on a trampoline. That's so funny. It's such a gen rant. It is. So funny. No, it's not that. Why am I on the floor? I'm sorry. I can't get out of the way. I'm a big fan of the Piquet. I've been working for 7 years. How do I get out of the way? Then all the guilt comes up. Seven years of work for you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. British accent? Can I have some bottle of water? Oh, can we just touch on this? This drives me nuts, right? Why do people always say British accent, right? And then it's an upper crust English accent. There are four <laughs> countries with 40 dialects in Britain. The upper crust English one, what you, uh, what you assume is a British accent, is <laughs> Kent in England. The, it's like East End of London. No, not even East End. It's just Kent. Kent in England. Queen's English, they call that. Yeah. That is proper upper crust English. It's not a British accent. I have a British accent. Does it sound anything like that? No. Why? Because Britain comprises of 40 different accents. Are you getting UK triggered here? <laughs> yes. You know why? Because yesterday I had so many people doing the whole, oh, I love a British accent every time they heard someone English. And I'm like, what the F am I? I'm British. <laughs> <laughs> I don't talk like that. So that, my dears, for educational purposes, is an upper crust Queen's English English uh, accent. I served on aircrafts as a flight attendant for like six years, so I saw every accent available in the UK. I can do an English it was... accent. It's just not desirable. <laughs> <laughs> uh, English, 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 upper crust, probably Kent. That's a Kent accent. The weird thing in in uh, America is people always ask me, oh, are you British? And I'm like, no, I'm South African. Does it really sound that similar? So. I can't say anything because, you know, Heather is South African too. And uh, when I first met Heather, yeah, I thought she was from England. <laughs> <laughs> but in my defense, though, Cape Town accent is a bit upper crusty and sort it of is. posh. And they do it's very sound. snobby. Yes. Yeah. And it's only in certain words where I actually can tell that she's South African. So that's in my yeah. defense. I thought she was like a landowner who wore hunting clothes <laughs> and shot foxes. That's how she sounded. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Professor? Shut up, Malfoy. Shut up, Shut Malfoy. Gentlemen? Can I have some bottle of water? <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Can I have some bottle some, of water? Shut up, my boy. Shut up, my boy. Can shut I have a bottle of water? Our baby, Mon. Yes, I'm your baby. Oh. 연습생 때 다들 연기 테스트를 받았었어요 한 번씩. 근데 제가 진짜 하기 못하겠다 그랬는데 했는데 저한테 다 끝나고 열변 열연 하는데 그 오신 분이 저한테 그러시더라고요. 죄송한데 <웃음> 교포세요? <웃음> oh hey, I'm from. Yeah, I'm from California. 막 이러면서 많이 <웃음> 저를 잘 모르는 사람들이 여러 낳고 다녔다는 후문이. I put on my white go. This boy does not need alcohol. Just got me broke, but I can dance so much. I put on my white. My God, is vocal monster. Yeah, you know that. Dance, dance, dance. Dance, dance. What on earth is going on? Can you do on high note? Yeah. <웃음> 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. <웃음> 안녕하세요. 옷이 왜 이렇게 Totally saw Sugar taking the absolute mince out of him there, <laughs> mimicking him at the side. I, you know what I love though? I love how BTS members hype each other up. They're like always like supportive in a way, but like they, they also teach each other like siblings, but they're also very supportive and like give each other moments in the spotlight. Do you know what I mean? Like some bands all just, you have members that are vying for the spotlight. But Attention. BTS, I will even say that word. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, BTS doesn't do that. They're just really like love each other so much. Genuinely. I want Adam's hat. I know. I'll have RM's hat. I have that same hat. I have a pink version of that hat, and it's like my favorite hat because the shape suits me. But I now want that one. That one is now mine. Please, thank you I'll very much. I need to find a black one now. I've got a black one. Also, can I just say his dancing here is pretty good for someone so awkward. <laughs> he's a good dancer. <laughs> In some videos, he's very awkward, but then this video is a very good dancer. You oh. haven't seen enough BTS videos. This uh, your phone is. is just exiting my lug. Oh, uh, title, 봄날인데 멜로디가 온통 보고 싶다. 보고 싶다. 보고 싶다. 이거밖에 없는 거야. Wind was blowing in leave like pee. so i was like oh leaves are falling <laughs> leaves are falling leaves are falling leaves are falling it was like this it's hard to believe sometimes this dude is actually in and a singing band <laughs> <laughs> And you know what's amazing is on Indigo, you haven't heard Indigo. He sings so well. Like he's just has to find his like right. I said I totally can sympathize with Adam, right? Because see, in the band, I could sing like a person that can actually sing. See, any time out of the band, any kind of singing, <laughs> I sound exactly like this. It's like your inability to sing properly when you're just not properly singing. <laughs> When you're practicing it and yeah i am the most tone deaf non-singer <laughs> but then you put me behind a mic in a studio when i'm being all serious and i can sing <laughs> it's weird <laughs> it's so funny i'm like the worst oh 방탄소년단 노래는 잘 모르겠어요 네 이런 친구가 있었는데 이번에 연락 왔습니다 
야 이번 노래는 좀 괜찮더라. 어 그래 어, 원래 괜찮 괜찮았거든. 네. 라고 했습니다. 진영 톤으로. 어 그래 어, 원래부터 괜찮았거든. <웃음> 여러분들 이거 혹시 주위에 방송 노래 안 좋아하는 분들이 있다면 봄날을 들려주세요. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. I gave you my chocolate. Today we all gonna die, but not today. Not today. Today. Adam, <웃음> 괜찮아? <laughs> He's like so. hyper. Like and it's so us hyper. on a like really high day. Yeah. Like it's, it's weird like to see morning. him. Because he's never like this in any of the clips you said and now like he's so like <laughs> That's why I wanted to show this to you. I haven't seen the full thing. I only saw like the beginning. I was like, no, Dean has to see this to understand the full dimension of RM. To feel more normal too. Now RM makes me feel normal. Yeah. yeah. T- I think t- I'd t- still be intimidated though because he seems to have way more high, wi- high wire energy than even me and that's really saying something. <laughs> well, you know what it is? He's unpredictable. So you don't know how he's going to respond to you. So He definitely reminds me of my pal. <laughs> we have a concert, but not today. It's Valentine's Day, so I don't know what I'm saying. Arigato! <laughs> the things about Pumdai, Spring Day. You know, you already know that it's the lyrics about it. It's things about friends. So I'm trying to say that if you have a friend, you know, like old friend or forgotten friend, you should you should call your you should call first and you should text first. Oh, I was forgotten about this friend, but. When you meet him again or meet her again, you know, it's a whole, whole new experience. How you doing, man? Yo, what's poppin'? <laughs> okay, get this guy. If my wings could fly. You know, there was Wings' original version and I made it, but it, it, it couldn't come out to the world because p Dog and PD Neem made it to a new version, but it was super, super dope and better. So I just, okay, I admit it. You got no language barriers between you and me, between BTS, BTS and ARMY. We, oh my God. We, up, we above the walls of language. You got it? Hi, baby. I'm not a, I'm not a person like this oh, you know, originally, usually. His voice is so everything though. He's, He's definitely calmed voice. down a lot. <laughs> <laughs> in uh, newer lives you can you definitely yeah. get that this is very like a much older RM, like younger rm but like an older video you know what I, yeah sorry i interrupted he's definitely much more mature and calm now and he's <laughs> he does but when you know what i've like figured it out i don't know if it's necessarily a linear thing i think that he wears his heart on his sleeve like if he's in a bad mood or if he's in a small Mm. like solemn mood he'll do that if he's in a more hyper mood he'll be that and i think like when um 2020 to 2021 when he was so upset and stressed and feeling like all the pressure of everything like you know him carrying the world on his shoulders it came across in his lives it came across in everything that that he did no, this, I think this is earlier, might, might be. But, like, yeah, he was definitely, like, a little quieter manic. on lives. <laughs> this seems but a little bit manic. <laughs> this is before, I think this might be before. I don't even know. I mean, do you know when this live was filmed? Because, like, so I feel like it's, like, with RM, his mood is based on a day-to-day basis. If he has had a good day and he does a live, like, you can see it. If he's had a bad day, sometimes he'll have a drink and have been going alive and you can feel that as well. But yeah, I think it just depends on his energy. Like I feel like he's very uh, like a sponge, like he absorbs a lot of energy from the world around him. And like that comes out of his mouth. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> you know what I mean? So especially if he's working on a project he's passionate about, you can like on the V lives, he seems way more energetic. Kind of like us when we're like <clears throat> working on something we're like invested in. Exactly. I'm a very sweet and calm and you know like. Are you sick? I'm not sick. Do I look like sick? I'm perfect. <laughs> I'm healthy. Nothing cool can help me do. Pizza sucks without you. <laughs> Cause pizza sucks without pizza. you. Don't drink too pizza. much coffee. Oh, thank you. I'll take a decaf. You are the love of my life. Thanks. Ayo. You are. Ciao. <laughs> <laughs>
그건 조금 나. 제가 어렸을 때 초등학생 때부터 항상 다녔던 문방구에 제휴 얼굴이 크게 걸려 있으니까 그래서 그걸 보고 있다가 쭉 보고 있다가 음 이렇게 보고 있다가 옆에 초등학생 이제 초등학생도 아닌 것 같아 유치원생 친구가 제가 너무 당황을 한 나머지 도망쳤을 때 어? 어? 혹시 하는데 제가 도망쳤어요 정말 미안합니다 혹시 이 VM을 보고 있다면 정말 그 그래서 사모님한테 이제 저거 사실 저예요 이러고 이제 호석이가 저는 아니지만 아무튼 방탄소년단이니까 저... Dude run away from my kindergarten child And apparently like a, a, a whole bunch of them and they all chased him down the road It's so funny See, when I was in that band, when we were first together, we got like so much publicity from like the newspapers and that straight off before we even had a song. They had put like our pictures everywhere. And we were together walking to our rehearsal um, place. It was like a big like nightclub place. We were together for the first time, like properly walking down the street. And we just heard some girls shout, oh my God, is that? And we turned out and I swear to God, there was a group of like 20 girls chased us and we had no idea what the hell was going on we had been together literally like two weeks and our pe- pictures had been everywhere but we were, hadn't even had <clears throat> one single proper rehearsal we hadn't even like made a song <laughs> so we were just innocently walking around and then we got absolutely chased like That's we didn't so know funny. what to do it was the funniest thing ever oh my god <laughs> 근데 이제 그 친구들이 뒤따라 나오더라고요. 근데 이제 내가 뛰었어요. 저도 모르게. Do you like Bruno Mars? I love Bruno Mars. Twenty four carat magic in the air. In the air. You look so beautiful. Don't worry. Thank you. <웃음> What on earth is he doing? 왠지? 넌 나의 약이야. 하지 마. Sing change. Well, let's go to change. How are you today? I'm feeling so fine. Woohoo! I'm feeling great. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling cool. Keep on what? Eo, eo, yoda, jari, jari, That was Mr. Bang, you know? He's more famous than us. The blonde hair is good. Good. How dare Sugar give you that leather jacket? That's for me. <laughs> That's the jacket I want. <laughs> He looks good with the blonde and the jacket. He does. No, no, the jacket is mine. Okay. That's <laughs> uh, so true. They definitely share clothes because that is Sugar's jacket. I recognize that a mile away because it's the one I now want. <laughs> Kunya, <laughs> 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 The German was like, I need to say something complimentary here, but I have no idea what's going on. I don't know, it's just a weirdo, so I'll say this with a straight face and then I'll leave. <laughs> <laughs> you will oh, become so a good cute. vocalist soon. Goodbye. Soon. soon. He's working on it. <laughs> oh, it's so <laughs> funny. <laughs> he left afraid. before he could be questioned. Ah, this guy's funny. Ah, he's very sexy. Man. BTS wasn't BTS. Twenty-one. 
이제 이제 커리어 만나러 왔는데 오, 아, 진정한, 진짜. 아니 뭐 음악뿐만 아니라 저는 음악에서도 진짜 영화 엄청 많고 왜냐면 지구상에 가장 섹시한 남자라고 생각했던 거 진짜 대박이에요 목소리가 진짜 네, 오, 목소리가 아, 진짜 완전 떨었어요 나는... 아니 감사해요 아미카 여러분도 딱 내적 댄스 할때 Louise, how is your dancing? They <laughs> did good job. I was like, oh, that's impressive. <laughs> like, imagine, imagine him standing in front of you doing that. I'll be like, oh. <laughs> Don't get out of the way. He's very clumsy. I don't want to die. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we are always dreamed of. There's a pizza now, man. <laughs> oh, mommy, come on. What's on his face? Pause. So the previous scene you saw where they're like, we're singing to him and then they spilled chocolate on him and then they put chocolate on his face then oh, he had to change and it was his favorite white sweater and then the next that i think it was a german or jun i can't remember who bought him the little cardi so he put the cardi on but he slid chocolate on his face <laughs> single chuka hamnita single chuka hamnita single chuka hamnita sarang what is it I can't remember. Can't remember. <laughs> Everything falls down outside. I'm not sure. 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 죽여버리겠습니다. <웃음> 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 No way. No way. You're my universe. You're my space. <웃음> <웃음> 어, 끄면 이따가 킬러할 때 나처럼 꺼진다. 아니, 예? He does not have to talk some random nonsense. <웃음> <웃음> He's so funny. I love him. You know what I like as well is like he has this passion for music that just seeps through in everything that he does you know you can see he's like happiest when he's singing when he's listening to tunes and he's geeking out he's just so happy that's my one regret is never learning to sit and be able to compile and produce the music like i wish i'd spent more time with um, sean our producer and learned those because i feel like i would be really good at it <laughs> yeah I, I think as whole. writers, we would probably be really good at composing music and songs and songwriting. I just have no clue about much of the music industry, so I'll stick to writing books for now. The closest I ever got to music producing was when Sean, our producer, was from a second band. He sent me um, music they had composed that he wasn't sure about lyrics for, and he wanted me to write the lyrics to go with his song. And instead of just writing the lyrics and handing <clears> it back <throat> to him because he wouldn't have any idea how they went to the music, I had to record and sing them and put them on to his track. That was the most music producing I've ever done. <laughs> like a yeah. demo track for him to hear it. And I don't yeah. even know what happened to that song. Obviously, we'd have got someone else to sing it. I wasn't in the band anymore. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. 
<laughs> He's got such a nice smile. He's got a nice face. He does. And he's got just that when he smiles without that self, like sometimes he does a self-conscious smile, but when he's just genuinely smiling, he's just so... You're my ideal type of future boyfriend. Oh my gosh. <laughs> His hair looks nice here. It does. And hair. And hair too. <laughs> he suits so many different hairstyles. Okay, I okay, I don't think there's any more to that. No, that's it. That definitely gave us a different insight into Adam and his crazy. <laughs> Besides, so you don't harsh. get to see much. Yeah, Especially you... me, because I don't really watch much BTS content. So I've only ever seen Adam, the leader, the speaking for the UN, Adam, the keeping them like in line and being Mr. Mature and clever and going on shows and doing maths quizzes at super high speed. Like I've never seen that crazy rambling, like what are you on? <laughs> <laughs> <At him. laughs> it makes me feel more normal. <laughs> I, know, I, swear. I just love it there as well that they can be themselves with army, you know, and just be like, Oh, I'm an idiot today. Or I'm like just fooling around or I'm just, but it's, he's just a door. Like, He's cute. Like he he's got such a like that side to him where he's just kind of like just so sweet. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I just the uh, soft-hearted Virgo with the um, chaotic yeah. energy that is sometimes a bit manic and a bit out there. Yeah. Exactly like my stepdad. That's exactly what my step my stepdad's the guy who is like a six foot odd hulking ex military guy who cries at romance movies and collects <laughs> teddy bears. But he's also crazy hyper like and comes out with the most random stuff. I see that in RM too. It must be a Virgo thing. Yeah, he's uh definitely he's he's definitely like uh very endearing in a lot of ways. So. Very charismatic as well. He is. And when he smiles, he's just like lights up a room, I think. So he's got those... See that version of Adam in that video, you would never think that he could be the look after everybody, keep everyone in line, Mr. Reliable. Like no. <laughs> he totally seems like a completely <laughs> different person. Well, and yeah. like, that makes me a little sad sometimes because I feel like being allocated as the leader of bts having all that responsibility he didn't get to enjoy as much time as the others did and he like he had to work so much harder with so much extra responsibility and i think jimin mentioned it once how like like he had so much on his shoulders like there was one camping trip that they did where um i think it was on in the soup and rm was like uh so stressed he couldn't relax i think they got him to peel potatoes to relax himself and he ended up because he had so much like they were on this camping thing and he had just had so much still coming through from like for work and like he could not relax and he was stressed and he even like i think he left the group and went and isolated himself and jimin came and sat with him and he said to jimin tell me it's going to be okay you know and i just feel so sad for him that he has to go through stuff like that so I, i'm glad like in this time where they're just before the military they've had time to themselves and i hope that he's like had happy moments and relaxed moments where he hasn't had to deal with that stress so I feel like the military will also be a mental break for him because he won't have to worry about mm. anything. Just doing exactly. as he's told, following orders and just worrying about the then, there and then. He won't have to think beyond. So it will be a good mental break for him. Exactly. Hopefully it will also teach them some like emotional resilience too and be better able to handle the stress when he gets back mm -hmm. out of the military yeah because he's gonna have a lot of stress returning so well that was a long reaction because it was a long video but it um, was it was it was, it was i'm thanks. less intimidated by adam now so yeah <laughs> yeah he's he's you know and i was thinking about his smile again sorry i keep talking about his smile but like it really caught me in this video i feel like all the members have really great smiles, but I feel like RM has like 
one of the best smiles in the K-pop industry. Like when he like smiles from his heart. He has a good smile. Yeah, he does. He has a really pretty smile. He does. Like, he's not I, like Adam's not my kind of like, what's nice. the word? Yeah. Okay, yeah. But I can still appreciate that he's handsome and he's like the best smile in BTS. I do think, I agree with you. He has the best smile in BTS, he even does. though Sugar has a nice smile. See, Aram is my bias along with Jin. I have two biases sitting on twin thrones. So. <laughs> yeah, I have two biases from different bands. Yeah, you have you have the Rose and Wusong and Sugar. Yeah, it's Alrighty. a very hard choice. Okay, we will catch you in the next video. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye.